Chopping techniques use an angled metal instrument to help disassemble the lens nucleus. They can be a little more difficult to master, but once learned, they help to reduce phaco time, especially with hard nuclei. The chopping techniques broadly fall into two categories, those which create a central space into which the nuclear fragments can be chopped, and those that don't. The latter can be a little more tricky. Stop and chop is the former, and was originally outlined by Paul Koch, who described a central sculpting of the nucleus, then stopping and changing to a chop technique. The stop and chop technique is a useful one to use as an introduction to nuclear chopping because it combines the familiar sculpting introduction of a FACO procedure with nuclear chopping in a safe environment and it can be converted to a divide and conquer technique at almost any stage. The initial stages of stop and chop involve making a deep central groove roughly the diameter of the lens. This creates space into which fragments can be chopped. 